super windy out here. Basically down in this little valley that kind of acts as a pinch point. Yeah, I think I drilled him. Michigan Whitetail Pursuit is brought to you by Fort Arrow Camera Arms, Final Rest, and Windset. It is November 12th. I wasn't planning on hunting this evening. Um, had my son, but uh, my wife told me, hey, why don't you get out there and hunt? So I'm not going to argue with her. Got uh, Only got about two and a half hours of light left, so I'm going to hurry up and squeak out there. I'm going to get uh, the rest of my stuff and head out. So we'll see you guys in the tree. All right, I'm all settled in. Super windy out here. I bumped a small eight point on my way in. I haven't hunted this stand. It's a, it's a stand I put up for my dad. It's a really, really sweet ladder stand. It's basically like a floating lawn chair in the sky. Basically down in this little valley that kind of acts as a pinch point. It's not a spot I expect to see a lot of movement, but it'll be more cruising related. However, with all the wind noise and everything, they'll probably be right on top of me before I even notice them. So we're gonna see if we can make it happen. Let's do it. Smoked him. Oh. Yes. Oh. I think I drilled him. Oh. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh. I wasn't even going to hunt tonight. I owe that all to my wife. She is awesome. I had my son today while she was working. She got off a little early and she told me, you know what? You should go hunt. So I just casually glance over and literally 25 yards behind me, that guy is standing there. He went through a shooting lane right here at 20 yards. I was gonna shoot him, but I'm very dedicated to getting the shot on film. So I let him go, let him pass. As luck would have it, he turned and started coming down this trail. I put the I put between my 20 and 30 yard pin uh, mid body, and I looked like I hit him uh, double lung. Hunted oh, so God. hard, and I'm not gonna lie, I've been getting rut anxiety. Like I haven't had a single mature buck since October 27th. I haven't seen a single one so. I have never hunted this stand, ever. Something tonight was just telling me, come sit here. <sighs> Unbelievable. Alright guys, it's sleeting pretty hard. I'm gonna get down, get back to the house, put it up on the big screen and get a better look. I'm gonna check first impact real quick. Uh, and then I will get with my dad and my brother and we'll go All from right, there. The cavalry's here, my dad and my brother are here. We're gonna get out there and get tracking. We'll keep you guys posted. 
All right, we made it to first blood. This is right at impact. We got a bunch of hair, nice bright red blood. It's been raining, so I can't see if there's any bubbles in it or not, but there's a lot of it. If you see on all these leaves in this tree, that's all blood. And it's blood over there. There's the knock glowing it off, but I think I got penetration up to like halfway. It's hard to tell. Looks about halfway of the arrow. If you felt it, it'd be oil. Rod had it super bent. I don't know if you can see that. It's all twisted. There he is, guys. Yes. Oh, yes. Yeah, baby. Those G2s. Oh my gosh, yes. What a beautiful buck. All right, guys, November 12th. Um, wasn't even gonna hunt tonight, but my wife took my son and told me go hunt, so I didn't argue with her. Um, got in the stand late and uh, I got into a stand tonight that I haven't hunted all season and something was telling me to go hunt it. Um, walking in I bumped a small eight point and was like eh, I probably shouldn't go into this stand but I still did and uh, shortly after this guy uh, came through behind a couple small does or button bucks not sure what they were but um, he was behind me, couldn't get the shot on camera, so I waited. He ended up taking a trail that was probably at 30 yards. I had one opening, stopped him, and I think I ended up getting both lungs. But uh, just ecstatic. This is just a gorgeous Michigan buck. Um, I think I have this deer on camera, but I'm not 100% sure. At first I didn't think so, but now that I saw this split, uh, I might actually have him on camera. But nonetheless, a massive Michigan buck. I've been hunting so hard. Um, just don't know what to say. I'm so excited. And, uh, yeah, this will definitely be one I'll remember. So, thanks for watching, guys, and, uh, stay safe out there.